So, pagka-graduate ko nung high school, wala na akong ibang course na gusto bukod dito. Parang buo na agad yung loob ko na dito, dito na agad, culinary na agad kunin ko. Ano eh, uh, from our family kasi, talagang mahilig kami magluto. Simula pala ako ng bata, nakikita ko na sila. So, nanonood na talaga ako. Tapos, naisip ko na, what if ito na lang talaga yung gawin ko? I've been working in a school for since 2004. I think this is my fourth school. I actually met uh, Sir Mark in my previous school, Sir Mark Tataroa, our school administrator. I'm also Chef Noel. When they decided to open a culinary school, they asked me to join them here in Pace. So I was one of the pioneer employees since Pace. Started in 2012. Hi, my name is Cherry, Cherry Balimasai. Um, I, like, ano lang yung pamangking ko, na inquire, eh yung pala, napasagi yung pala. Bago pala ako sa Pace eh, it's, it's like seven months pa lang ako na nag-work dito. And, ayun, uh, Hindi ko expect na maging part ng face kasi uh, from the interview, sobrang uh, ang dami. Ang dami na daw na nag interview so... We would like to think that uh, part of our growth and our um, strong points is that we have good people. Ang goal namin kasi dito sa PACE, kung ano yung goal ng isa, goal ng lahat. Yung support namin, yung support system namin sa PACE, na kahit ano mangyari, matalo matalo, uh, winners pa rin kami. Sa, sa PACE family and sa sigle namin. The value that we would like to teach them is the importance of being passionate in everything that you do. So be, be it that you are a frontliner or you are a steward in the kitchen, you should have that extreme desire to perform your task every day because all tasks we believe are all important for the success of the school. So, every time na when I do something and it affects or influences other people in a positive way, that's the time na nakikin ko na sobrang proud ako. Alam parang naapektuhan mo yung buhay ng tao and then yung impact mo sa kanya in that sense. We are very supportive visa students who would like to continue school and make it affordable for them to have an education, a culinary education that they can avail. So it takes a while for them to ano, ma, ma finish school, they will be still they will still be able to finish it. And all of these things we inculcate all of this, no, sa students day one pala, the values, we may never change them for their habits, but we want them to understand what this profession requires, the professionalism, the passion, the social discipline, most of, most of our students, no? it's their first time, no matter what their age is, we, we want to show to them that this amount of passion, basically, it's really because we care about the customers. Many times, pesos na parang gusto mong gumive up, uh, nasistress ka na, uh, lahat ng trabaho, pero but still, bumubangot ka dahil nga sa mga kasama mo din, which is hindi ka nila pinapagaya. One thing na ano siguro, no, madalas na naririnig ko sa mga uh, students namin is yung value for money. Kasi dito parang nagpili nila na uh, wala silang dupin. 
Mm-hmm. The, the school na uh, we give an after service na teaching doon sa mga alumni and graduates ano. Like if they want to put up business, they're freely uh ikaw nga pwede kang bumalik dito. Gawin natin yung uh, project mo na parang consultancy pero that's for free, no? Kasi ganoon namin binabalue yung aming mga graduates and students. No? Yeah, I started off also as a student. So I can closely relate to the idea of actually studying culinary arts because I was a student way back in 1992, which was a long time ago. Uh, I studied abroad because during that time there were no uh, available culinary schools that were professional in the Philippines. Right now we have, we're concurrently uh, discussing plans of a school somewhere in Tagaytay, which actually has to do with wellness and, uh, and healing. And concurrently, we also have something ongoing on in Makati uh, Central District. Hopefully, uh, another culinary school by school uh, by June. So, in short, uh, there are many things that are causing us to progress faster than what we imagined. But then, I guess, just like anything that is actually you know um, running according to plan, uh, things like this uh, naturally happen. And in the future, I'm sure um, the goals will be not far from what uh, we how we started but then again that's actually the beauty of something that works as a system you begin and end with the same goal in mind hi this is Giselle of batch 14 and i'm currently working here at the resort here in south bay southern california and this is actually my dream but I never imagined myself working outside our country. But like what I said, pangarap ko to. So, I just give it a shot. Nung nagkaroon ng interview para sa mga intern dito. So, yun, nakapasa naman ako. So, here I am, working here. And I'm happy na nakasama ako sa mga nakapunta dito. Hi everyone, my name is Mona and I'm from batch 6 place. Uh, currently, I'm in uh, Dubai. I'm uh, working with Palazzo Versace Hotel. And yesterday, we just actually did a grand opening. So it was really tiring day. Uh, I started my work from uh, 9 in the morning and I ended up going home around 12 midnight. Yes. Well, anyway, it's a, it's the job of a chef. Hello, Pace. How are you all? I'm Jimmy, Batch 14, 15, 16, 17. I'm here now in London. Sa ka London Eye. Ngayon, may trabaho na ako dito sa London. Masaya, malaki ang respeto ng mga tao sa mga Pinoy kasi masisipan. I'm JP Desus from Batch 4 of Culinary Arts Diploma of PACE. I'm currently here in Los Angeles, California working as an Cook 3 intern in Terranea Resort. Good luck to all applicants. God bless you all. Always keep your night shut.